Welcome back to the episode. No, no, no. We'll do it when we get back. So we're not walking. No. 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 They pay for this. Pay for this? Let him watch. Alright, well apparently you got a question for me, so alright, let's start episode 10. Alright, so... In case you're wondering why we're redoing really this, it's because the emulation oh. crash. It does that oh. sometimes. Yep. Uh, so, have you looked at the tier list for Smash Ultimate recently? No. So, I don't follow tier lists as religion. I just want to note that. I, I know that they're they're important of the relevance of the meta at the moment. That's what they are. It's what Bayonetta is still broken for, and Meta is still broken in the Um... So, Roy Boy's number two. Is he? <laughs> Roy Boy got up there. Yeah. And Ike is number eight. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like with Ultimate especially, the tier just really doesn't matter. It does, actually, to a certain extent, yeah. It does. I play Kirby, and I keep seeing Kirby mains wreck shop, so I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, it ba it's based on who gets farthest in the in the turns. That's kind of a weak suggestion. Not, not really. I feel like that's one of those things where it's that, like... That's called max potential basis right there. That, that makes sense. If you base it based on the max potential that's been showcased, who has done the best? That is what they base tier lists on. That's what they've always based tier lists on. That's why Jigglypuff is so high in Melee. Also, I forgot to grab this a while back. <laughs> but then it's just sitting out in the open. Yeah. Well, it's good we got it. Yeah, I yeah, know. The tier lists, especially for Ultimate, are still relevant. Especially since Ultimate works on the Melee basis of being a lot faster. Being able to wave dash is back. Well, I think what I mean by with uh, it doing it by the tournament sale... I kind of feel like more people are going to play it based on the tier list, and thus the better players are. It's going to get a lot more of the like better players playing those characters because so more people. What people are playing based on, you, and you, thus it's going to be a sub failing prophecy because now well, they're my, getting my, further my, in the tournament. No, that's not how Because there's so works. much more of them. That's not how that works, though. You know why Jigglypuff is as high as he is? Because nobody wanted to fucking play him. Somebody brought him out and was like, Hey, you can rest somebody in the middle of the air after the wall of pain. <laughs> People explore these things. What the basis is based on is what everyone has played. I don't know. And everyone has played the, every character at this point. Hero included. And they've made a basis on this for competitive scenes. Hero's not on the tier list yet because he has not been showcased in competitive high enough yet. Okay. Yeah, I just don't understand tier lists. I just play as whoever. Well, I mean, that's fine. They, they're not trying to be like, you can't play as these. That's why I said I don't use it as gospel, and nobody else should either. Everyone whose base is something on the tier list never will say, this is the end-all, be-all. Because if they do... Like, there are certain characters that are end-all, be-all the best characters in the game. We can agree to that. Proper? Yeah. yeah. is the best in four. That's not an argument. That's a fact. I don't know, I just feel like people who rely on tier lists well, if they rely aren't on, actually really doing that good at the game. If they're relying on tier lists, then that's not what I'm talking about, then. I'm talking about utilizing it as a basis for who's been considered good in the competitive scene at the moment. Yep. If you want to play as those characters, that is your choice. But it is meant to be a guideline to tell us who has been doing good. Okay. It's kind of like a, a point sheet for a team. All right, that's fair. Yeah, no, it's it's it shouldn't be thought of because I think every it gets a bad rap for everyone thinking of it as, well, this is who you have to play as. No, I mean that never made that that argument. Jigglypuff wasn't even on the tier list until somebody brought him up and beat the shit out of somebody with him. Yeah. Same thing with Ike. I bet you money he was back in the 30s again. I think he was. I do remember checking the tier list once way early on. And then they realized his Nair is fucking stupid. And it's such a good combo mix-up that it can break through most attacks. Oh, yeah? King K. Rool used to be top tier. He's not. Because he has so much input lag on some of his moves. Yeah. And you can counter those so well, and his counter isn't doing enough to pay it back. He's also such a big target, and that kind of kicks my tail. One of my mains, Donkey Kong, has never been high tier. Ever. Ever. I think the highest he's ever been is maybe in the top 20. But. Oh yeah, we got this going on. Yeah, no, I'm watching. <laughs> These monsters. This is easy. This is easy, chunky smash things. So difficult. Oh, 
Oh no! So difficult. <laughs> but yeah, no. Uh, so, Ike Boy, Ike Boy, and and Roy Boy got up there. Yeah. Because Roy, as you know, in Smash Four, didn't do so well in the competitive scene. And Roy just didn't do anything in Melee. <laughs> he did nothing. <laughs> and in this one, what they did to make him better is they upped his final smash to still be critical, but instead of Lucina's, where it does the thing, his will grab you from behind him, pull you to the front, and make you take it. Because he has AoEs. I'm talking a lot of Smash, I'm sorry. Yeah. I love Smash. Oh, I do too. I just don't get into the competitive side of it. There are some pretty cool matches on the competitive side of it. If you watch some Pikachu I occasionally match. watch them. Yeah, it's like the Melee Pikachu match. Oh my god. Pikachu versus fucking Fox. And he just fucking kept him on the kept him under every time he jumped off the stage. He'd be like, "No, get get down there, get down there," and then he'd go back up because yeah. he can double, he can double fall. Anyways, it's your turn to what? What am I doing? That temple is tiny. What am I doing? Entering that temple is tiny. I'm plugging in your controller. That's what I'm doing. Yeah. No, the one I was just in, the temple, Joey. Oh, you pointed your face that way. Yeah, Jack Wagon. Yeah. yeah, Turd Ferguson. Yeah. Yeah, Fudge Muffin. Fudge Muffin. That's what you are. Yeah, probably. <laughs> Joey. What? <laughs> These slippy edges, man. They're really getting you, aren't they? I. It's. It actually is kind of annoying. <laughs> like I, it, it's legitimately kind of annoying. The tiny switches on the left. Mm -hmm. Oh no, wait. No, it was on the right. I, I was wrong. I apologize. You're always wrong. It's fine. Oh yeah. I'm used to it at this point. This point. Okay, now just go through the hole. I don't ever want to hear you say that to me. <laughs> G gently, smoothly. Don't go too fast. Bro, she's a kid. <laughs> I don't know what monkey rules are, but obviously she follows a lot of human uh, rules. Where am I going? Alright, down there, first. Alright, push Z to go down. Or R, yeah. I was about to say, what one is Z? Alright, go through there first. Could do a little bit of cleanup. Head to the right into her room. There's some uh, balloons to pop. Balloons. Let's get rid of these first. I mean, they're gonna respawn real quick, so chasing them all down isn't really gonna I work. I don't care. I don't care. I gotta get used to her fucking fighting style. Yeah, it's about the same as everyone else's. Yeah, but the range is different. Okay, you got a lot of ammo, bro. Spray and pray. <laughs> this one. Yeah, these balloons, though, they're the death perception hell of this game. It's pretty nasty. Alright, now you're gonna go through the other entrance where Linky was. There were some coins to grab. Go ahead to the right. There you go. Alright, now head back up to the top area. Uh, before you head back up, I'll look around for a hole down here. There should be a hole that you can go through as tiny, tiny. Okay. Please, camera. Yeah, okay, remember where that is, so because you're gonna have to run there once you go tiny. All right, where we're going up here. Yep. Can I? <laughs> Maybe. No, not not that. That's a that's a torch. Joey. Are you kidding me right now? 
No, Joey. she glitched in. Jo Joey! <laughs> Let me see this. Wait, wait, oh, wait. wait. Oh, you did there it. There you go. When I'm... I said up there, I meant up here. So here? Yes. Okay. Into the barrel to shrink yourself down. And now run to the hole! See, now that you're smaller, you can fit into the hole better. That's a joy, bananas. There you go. Trust me, you're gonna wanna get used to these swimming controls. Level 4 is the water level. <laughs> Alright, uh, push, uh, crouch and then push to the left. Or right. Oh, I guess you can't do it. Alright, never mind. So, I can't remember what to do in here. So, start ground pounding and see what happens. Yep. Alright. Look up. Okay. Yo, it ain't me, it's y'all shit. <laughs> <laughs> Buy a new one, cheapskate. <laughs> Alright, uh, try to break- oh, there you go. Oh, is this just another murder shit thing? Yup. Wow, that was so easy. <laughs> Sorry, after all those hard ones we've been doing, I just get shocked sometimes, man. <laughs> <laughs> I get like a little shell shock feeling. Alright, well, out you go. The song is annoying. Oh, yeah. Alright, well, jump out. Alright, now try to grow back with the. Yeah, there you go. Alright, well, up the temple. <laughs> We're done! <laughs> with this place. Temple complete. Dude. Uh, you walked by the hole that you were supposed to go through. Oh. Listen, I know it's fun to go in, but sometimes you gotta remove to pull out. <laughs> I like how you say sometimes. You don't know how contraception works. Now, <laughs> uh, okay, so, uh, you know what? We're gonna flip to Chunky, so. I'm trying to remember what we're doing next, but it's Chunkums. There you go, boss man. Alright. We're supposed to do you for this. Let's grow big. And walk into the monster. What's up? I don't know why you didn't show up the last time we did this. Because uh, this is the first area they expect you to do it. No. We got this in the last day. Yeah, never mind. Is there anything worth the grip? Oh, yeah, that happens sometimes if you go where you're not supposed to go. There's no balloons over there. Alright. Just make it sure. We don't need a chunk of or anything. I need to get more for something. Oh, uh, yeah. Cranky, I'll give it, so going over there to do it. But, eh. Grab this. Go. Easy. Crystal coconuts, because you know. Yeah, I'm not too worried about running out because there's crystal coconuts everywhere in this level. Fair enough. This is the level where they're like, here's how you use your abilities. Fair enough. Let's pop into this. Wait, what mini game is this? Busty Barrel Barrage! It says busy. What? It's not busty, Jesse. No boobs. I know. Oh. You suck! So yeah, you gotta be quick on this. Failure. 
We gotta shoot some bitches. They played odd job, it's not fair. Okay, yeah, once you get past this first one, you can kind of spread them out a little bit more, it becomes easy as shit. Also, I can just rapid fire. Well, you could. I wonder why you haven't been doing that. <laughs> ben and Ugh! Well, it's no beaver bother. <laughs> At least. I still got one more of those. Yeah. In your future. I told you, I ain't doing that one. That's all you. That one's you. Nah, I'm the guest. You'll make me play that. Oh, I'll make you play whatever I want. Nah, that's all you. I'm sorry you think it's me, but it's you. <laughs> Under this misinterpretation of you think you can get me to play it. I'm gonna watch you get red again, and it's gonna be funny. <laughs> Alright, so do you wanna do the really difficult one, or do you wanna wait until next session? It's up to you. Alright, you're doing it. <laughs> First, I'm gonna grab some bananas. Tasty, tasty green bananas. Nice and sweet. I'll keep this in mind though, because you're still doing it. <laughs> That's all you. I'm gonna remind you every single recording session we have. Uh, you, I hope you remember, because it's not until pretty much the end of the game. Oh, I won't. Alright, so first you're gonna be Diddy. Gotcha, what am I doing? Go down there. There should be some gongs along the side that you should you can grab. Yeah, see those gongs? Smash them. Also, were those the first three bananas we got as Diddy for here? I don't know. Oh no wait, we fed them to the monster, that's right. Also, bananas up on the trees. I'm gonna get them after. You'll be grabbing that way later, don't worry about that. Okay, what are we doing? Grab the bananas on top of the trees, real quick. Okay. So, remember a while back when I asked how you like slides? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna be doing this here soon. Grab the tree. Come on, Back buddy. up a little bit. You know, they don't like grabbing the tree if you're right up against it. I've noticed. Playing that, be, that beaver bother shit? No, oh, yeah. I don't want to do it unless I want to do it. One more uh, tree on the other side there. Pardon me, camera. <laughs> Now, uh, go switch to tiny. Oh, wait. You can't do it quite yet. Never mind. Uh, go to the right. Remember, you gotta unlock the pad first. So, uh, go across there. Just jump. Just, just tank it. Damage boost. And, uh, go up there. To the left. Nope. Up there. Rocket barreling. Grab out uh, the coconuts first. Make sure you're used up. So what you're gonna be doing is you're gonna be jumping in there. Remember to hold the jump button once you get in to start flying. Alright. Now go grab that banana. Now you can do the thing we're supposed to do. Okay. So go become tiny. <laughs> be be become the tiny Kong. Now 
Now hop into that barrel, and then go uh, hit the pad while you're small. This one? Yep. Yeah. Oh. It would have been funnier if it was like a tiny little zoot suit sound. <laughs> oh, yeah. So Squat's gonna kidnap you and take you to a place you definitely don't want to go. His home where he'll feed me. Yeah, hopefully. Feed his birds. And it's full. Oh, it's a race. Okay. Oh, yeah. And collect 50 coins. If you hit him while you're going for the run up, you could stun him for a sec. Also, if he touches you, you lose your coins. That would have been nice. Oh, now. and you failed. That's all. Over. We can keep going for the last until it's the last episode. I don't mind. Alright, well, this is the last episode. There you go. Yeah, 10 more minutes. This is your planned misery. Remember, I said all the other misery wasn't planned. This is the one that was planned. <laughs> Take a hit. Oh, and you failed. Oh. <laughs> Notice how I'm not screaming in anger? Yeah, you gave you an any calm. You know you'll only be feeding me if you get angry. I know. What? Which is why I'll never feed you. It's pretty fun. Oh, well, there goes your coins. I missed the right direction. Oh no. Remember, you have to get 50 of these coins. Yeah, I know. I don't even know the stage yet, though, which yeah. is what I'm trying to learn. So this will take a while. Oh, it will. Mm -hmm. Boy, that was annoying. Oh, yeah. Why can't I turn very well? Uh, you can pull back to slow down. Oh, I know. But, like, the, the turning isn't very good. Oh, I know. Yeah. Th there's a reason why this one's infamous. <laughs> I thought the one you did was infamous. Oh, no, this one's infamous, too. You think they ain't multiple infamous ones? <laughs> oh, no. Th you think this game is so easy that you can just be like, Oh, you, we did the hard one, no more. <laughs> I still, want, I still gotta learn the stage. I'm planning on dying this time, too. I got one's left, too. Left. But yes, yeah, so learning the stage is basically what the guide said is like, alright, you figure this out. But yeah, trying to overtake him at the beginning, I remember, is usually a waste of time. You usually wanna focus on grabbing coins and then overtake him in the second half. Oh, and not fucked up on that one. All right, getting further though. Yep. Did I did I accidentally overtake him there? You were way ahead of him. Oh, he's really slow. Yeah, racing isn't the problem. It's getting those damn coins. Oh, that's fine. All right then. Just wanted to get you. I already knew that he'd overtake me when I did that. I mean, you do still have to race him though. Yeah, I think this tunnel's a good place to try and overtake him, so that way you're not uh, running no, into him. There's, there's no way I wasn't going to run into him there. Oh, 
Oh, Ooh. No. Nah. Remember, you could jump too. I don't know if that helps with your turning, but. I kind of said winning, retired. Yeah. Charlie Sheen. The, the game plan for his life. Well, at least this one doesn't try to glitch you out. This one's just playing difficulty. Sound bite is really <laughs> bad. Oh, yeah, he's laughing. He's mocking you, Joey. Yeah, well. He knows you're bad at this game. No, well, at least I'm not a bug. Huh? No. You're trying to get me mad. <laughs> you're attempting. Yeah, I'm not even really trying that hard. Don't quit your day job, that's all I'll say about it. Well, this is it. Really, my day job, so you know. Oh no. Ah. You got five more minutes, Jerry. Well, if I can't do it in five more minutes, we'll do it next time. Whatever. Yeah. Nice and calm. And he's still in the space too. Watch out for the sneak turn coming up. Oh, maybe it was right here. Yeah, right here. Oh, well. Don't worry, Joey. I think you got this. Eventually. You're Mr. Good at video games. I mean, it's always eventually. Yeah, it's always eventually. <laughs> eventually. Time, Joey. Yeah, I know. I'm starting to get it. Yeah, you might be able to do this in the three minutes it takes. I doubt it. But we'll see.
look out for Tatum. <laughs> I'm trying my best. Maximum drift. Put deja vu over that. All right, slow down. Nope, not quite enough. Nope. Yep. Oh well. Also, during that little foot race at the end, ah, uh, you could still hit him. Well, I didn't have enough, though. Yeah. I gotta get more. I was close, though. You were close! You were mentioning Mr. Fit when we were talking about this a while ago, and he does have a headband on him. Oh, well. Ooh. Yeah, I don't think this is gonna happen this episode. <laughs> Thing is, do you want to wait because this is the last episode? Do you want to wait until uh, next uh, recording session and lose all your skills? I think the skills will be will still be there. I don't know. You don't know? We'll have to see. Because you're getting real close. I feel like if we want to just extend it by like five minutes or ten minutes. Nah. Nah, don't do that, because if you overplay something, then you get too into it and you start losing your focus. Alright. One more time, then, Joey. This is really your last attempt. Yep, I'll give it one more shot. I tried, ladies and germs. I'll get to it next time on yeah. Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> well, I hope you uh, enjoyed this episode of Complete Silence. Oh, man. I get, quiet. I get quiet when I got focused. Oh, I know. I know. I didn't want to talk because I knew that might ruin your focus. I mean, you're more than welcome to attempt to, to break my focus. I'm not going to get <laughs> mad at you. <laughs> well. I'm, I laughed the fuck out of the entire time you were having your, <laughs> your fucking heart. I don't mind. <laughs> Go for it. All right. Well, we'll say that for next time. Until then, see you, everyone. Bye. No, actually, real quick, everyone. There is one thing I want to show you at the end of this recording oh. session. Oh shit. What's oh, I know. What's going on? Well, this is a Banjo Kazooie game, right? No. <laughs> It's basically one. It's not. It's its diseased younger it brother. Would control better. Yeah. Well, if you quit game, there's actually a game over sequence. Oh. Yeah. We gotta chill that off real quick. Is this the one where he shoots the the Kong Island? Huh? I think they. We were talking about Smash Bros. Ultimate earlier. I was about to say they showed this in Smash. Yeah. Laughing while push mashing buttons. I like how he's he's kicking his feet together. Oh uh, yeah, that's how you know he's in it. Game over. And out comes the chest spike. Nice lightning and shit. Ooh, and then cliffhanger time. for twenty years. That's right. <laughs> they don't show what happens until. Ultimate. <laughs> then they fucking murder the island. Oh yeah. Oh, he kills it. I don't like Ridley's very much though. You know? No. Alright. Well anyways, that's all.